Hey guys, you are watching In the Kitchen with Chloe and I will be cooking my infamous vegan sugar cookies. Hopefully I don't burn down the kitchen. To begin, we will be mixing half a cup of vegan butter and a cup of sugar. Sometimes I like to do a cup and a half of sugar. Mix that up together. The very first time I made vegan sugar cookies was five years ago for Christmas. And then I became obsessed because I love food. So I would make them every three days. What I like about being vegan is that you can pretty much take any recipe and all you have to do is substitute it. Usually with cookies, it would require egg. I have my vegan egg replacer, or you can use applesauce. I usually tend to like the applesauce because it makes it a little sweeter but you can choose. <coughs> I tend to like to double up that applesauce because it'll make it a little more moist. <laughs> awesome. For extra sweetness, you go in with your vanilla extract. I like to do a little extra. One of my favorite little things to add as well is almond extract. I feel like I'm making a magic potion. Then we continue to mix it up. It smells like heaven. Like sweetness. Look at that. It looks like caramel goodness. Now in our separate bowl, we're going to put our flour and a little bit of salt. I only do like a dash and some baking powder. Baking powder. Tomato, tomato, fuck it. Okay, there we go, there we go. Okay. All right. You're gonna do a dash of salt. Mix it up. Mix it up. Let's slowly pour our flour mixture into the sweetness delight. Slowly, slowly. Yup, yup. Get that up in there. Yup, just like that. Okay, got it all out. Now we're gonna get to mixing. It's pretty thick. But that's how we know we're doing it right. Sometimes it tends to get stuck in this, so then I just go like that. I still might add a little more extract, but I like things sweet. They're gonna be good, watch. Ooh, my arm's burning. Oh, thanks. But we have to put this in the fridge so it could get a little harder. So it could get a little more solid. So we'll wait for a couple minutes and then it's time to cut some cookies. So while we wait, I'm going to put some flour and prep. Get this out of the bowl and on to the counter. Make sure the counter's clean. Ooh, nice. I haven't made these in so long. A little more flour, just to make it a little less gooey. There we go. We have our nice cookie dough. Now we're gonna roll it out. It smells so good. We have our handy dandy shapes. Got a star. Have a cross because I love the Lord. A flower, because I love flowers. I have a heart, because love is important. Because I be making dough. butter up the pan because we don't want it to stick to the pan. But then I like using the vegan butter because it adds a little bit to the taste. Okay, 
Okay, it's buttered down. Honestly, I'm just gonna make a mint of balls. So you just roll them up to your liking. Look at that. You gotta, see this is so much more simpler than the cute little shapes. Boom. What was once a heart will now be destroyed. And now it's going in the oven. Preheat the oven to 375, and we're gonna leave it in there for 10 minutes. I'm actually really excited to try these because I didn't eat lunch, so I'll probably eat all of these by myself. There we have it. Shall we take a bite? Mm. <laughs> and there you have it. These are my favorite vegan sugar cookies. And you are watching In the Kitchen with Chloe. And I'm about to eat the rest of the plate. Goodbye. Bye-bye. Mm, mm, mm.